Hey, what's up everyone? Monado Max here. And today we're going to be talking about Donkey Kong. Yes, the Donkey Kong. In case you have not heard, it is actually Donkey Kong's 40th anniversary this year. And interestingly enough, we have not seen a brand new Donkey Kong game since 2014. So, I'm going to go ahead and say it might be possible. We're going to be talking about a lot of Donkey Kong in this video. A lot of you might say, oh, we actually got a Donkey Kong game in 2018. No, you did not. It was a port. We're not talking about Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze. That was for the Wii U. That is a port. No, we have not seen a new Donkey Kong game since 2014. That is what I'm saying in this video. So let's go ahead and talk about the elephant in the room. Obviously, a new Donkey Kong game has more recently been rumored by Nate Drake. And he is suggesting that the new Donkey Kong game is actually going to be developed by the Odyssey team. Not the studio. I want to go ahead and say that off the record. Not the studio. It's just the Odyssey team. So, I actually want to talk about that for just a little bit. I think this could very well be possible. I don't think we're going to see another 3D Mario game on the Switch. We're about to hit, hit the Switch's life cycle. Probably this March, I would say the Switch has maybe four more years. I don't think they're going to make a new 3D Mario game anymore for this system at least. I think we're going to see this team make one more Switch game. That Switch game probably being Donkey Kong. And then after they're done with that, they're actually going to make a brand new Mario game for the next Nintendo console. The reason why I say that, the only reason why these studios make sequels like, for example, Super Mario Galaxy. We had a Super Mario Galaxy 2 because they had ideas to make a sequel. Any other Nintendo platform, we've not seen sequels to the 3D Mario games. And I'm not saying the Odyssey team doesn't have ideas for Odyssey 2, if there was to ever be an Odyssey 2. But right now, I'm going to say it doesn't make sense that they would do that, just because there's a lot that that team can do. The new Donkey Kong game, would it be 3D, 2D? I don't know. So obviously, Retro is not making the next Donkey Kong game. They're obviously busy on Metroid Prime 4. And before Metroid Prime 4, some people might say uh, they were probably working on the next Donkey Kong game. It would seem that Retro was most likely working on a brand new IP after they released Tropical Freeze. And unfortunately, we don't know what that new IP was. We got sort of hints from the Reggie photo that they sent to Reggie when he was retiring, but we still have no idea what the IP was, if, if it's even going to come out, first of all. I hope we see that one day. I'm going to go ahead and assume it's a canceled project, but it, it looks pretty interesting. But my whole point is, this team is most likely going to be working on something else instead of the new Mario game. Because, I mean, in my opinion, we're not going to see the next Nintendo console for another four years. So that's how I feel on that topic. And it fits because, I mean, we don't really have a Donkey Kong game for the Switch. Tropical Freeze, I guess, but we don't have a mainline Donkey Kong game for the Switch. And it seems like, if we look at Nintendo's track record, ever since the Wii, they want to do more with Donkey Kong. They mean, they had Donkey Kong Country Returns for the Wii, and then right after they made Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze. So I think Nintendo really cares about this franchise. And the sell numbers for Tropical Freeze on the Switch do not lie. So I believe it would be wise for Nintendo to capitalize on the Donkey Kong anniversary. Because as we can see with Nintendo, they like to capitalize on anniversaries. We've seen this with Kirby, and we've more recently seen this with the last... Mario anniversaries like the 25th and 30 or the 30th and 35th anniversaries. So I would not be surprised if we see all this Donkey Kong game. I'm gonna go ahead and believe in Nate Drake and say, yes, this is probably true because I mean Nate Drake's track record is very impressive. You're probably gonna see a lot more games being announced because of their anniversaries like Zelda. Just pointing that out there. Now, originally, I'm going to be honest, I did not think there would be a new Donkey Kong game, but ever since Nate Drake has talked about the Odyssey team, I started thinking, this is very likely 
that the, at least the Odyssey team would be making a brand new game. I'm not saying it would be Donkey Kong, but it makes sense that the Odyssey team is not going ahead and making the next 3D Mario game since we got another four years left of the Switch. That's a whole nother development team that could be working on another title for the Switch. That being a huge title for the Switch. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say Odyssey team is working on something huge. And I'm going to go ahead and say Donkey Kong, Nate, Nate Drake saying it, so I'm going to believe in that. Originally though, I thought Nintendo was not going to do crap for Donkey Kong's anniversary. Mainly because... To me, I don't feel like they care about that character, at least more recently. I know I just said the track record shows, but I don't know. Just the way that they did Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze, I saw no promotional for that game. They, they didn't really do a good job promoting it. They didn't really do a good job with the port. I mean, it's a good port, but nothing new. It was just starting to seem like they just threw that out there. So I, the most that I honestly thought Donkey Kong was gonna get was probably Donkey Kong Country Returns HD. That to me made the most sense. That, I, that That's what I was expecting. I'm not saying you're gonna see that. I just wanted to throw that since this is a Donkey Kong 40th anniversary type video. Another thing I wanted to point out with Donkey Kong, a lot of people are thinking that Next Level Games is probably working on the new Donkey Kong game or just something huge with Nintendo. I'm gonna be honest with you, I do not believe that Next Level Games is working on any other Nintendo project than Luigi's Mansion. Luigi's Mansion 3 was released in 2019, and I feel, or in 2019, 2020, I feel, or no, 2019, <laughs> um, I feel that, in my personal opinion, I feel like that team is actually working on the next Luigi's Mansion game. Mainly because Luigi's Mansion 3 has sold way beyond Nintendo's expectations and still is selling like crazy to this day. We're probably about to see in the next Nintendo's investors a meeting that this game sold past 10 million copies. Because I believe in the last investors meeting they said that game was a little bit over 8 million copies. That is huge for a Luigi game and just the Luigi's Mansion series alone. So I'm going to go ahead and say that that team, with how late that game came out in the Switch's life cycle, they're probably working on the next Nintendo console making a game for that system. I wouldn't see them making another game for the Switch just because of how late we're into the cycle. Maybe I'm wrong. Obviously, that that's a small team, so I don't know if they would be doing multiple projects, but that's how I see it. Let me know how you guys feel on that. And yeah, so I think this is gonna end the video. I think we talked a lot about Donkey Kong's anniversary. I wanna know what you guys are thinking. Do you guys think we're gonna see something for Donkey Kong's anniversary? I originally was going ahead and saying no, and if we were gonna get, see something, it was Country Returns HD. We talked about that already. But I'm now switching my mind since Nate Drake, very credible leaker, talking about this and he opened my eyes i'm not gonna lie especially like he opened my eyes so i'm gonna go ahead and stop talking i've talked way too much in this video let me know your guys's opinions all that down below make sure to backslash that subscribe button like the video check out our discord server and follow me on twitter i will see you guys in the next video peace